Hello there, guys. Uh, or guy, whoever. I mean, maybe only one person's watching this. Uh, George, maybe. Um, yeah, so this is going to be a little video about some duels I did. Uh, most of them didn't go very successfully. Uh, there's a fair bit of cheesy tactics in there which are quite annoying. Um, and, you know, if it, they don't make things a fair fight, basically. I was trying to make it, you know, just a 1v1 with weapons. Maybe the occasional bit of magic here and there, but yeah. Uh, I got close on some of them. Pretty close on some of them. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to commentate them and... Um, yeah, we'll see. So basically, I've already recorded the fights. Um, I'm just doing a commentary over it. Anyway, here we go. So here we have the first fight. Um, yeah, I was like, "What's he even going to fight with?" Uh, but he put on his um, he put on his boxing gloves in a moment. So obviously, a little bit of buffing at the beginning here. I do, you know, do a little courteous greeting, and then we're off. So this first fight. Uh, here we go. There you go. There's his weapons. Oh no, actually no, he doesn't yet, doesn't he? He's the magic dude. Um, I thought it was the wrong one. So yeah, I get a bit, yeah, I get a bit confused. His spells get me because they're a little bit, I'm just being bad. This is the first fight. I'm just kind of rolling. And then he whips out this thing, which is just boring as hell. Piggy Chungus. It's like, just come on. No need for it. But I should really run around circles and come in and punish him because he's, you know, he's completely dead in the air, uh, which I don't do. I, sh I should punish these more. Here comes another dragon, and I think this one gets me. Yeah, that one gets me. Uh, and then I've got barely any health left, and got no legs to stand on. I roll in. Managed to, I think I get a hit on him. Yeah, he does more magic, which is, you know, fair enough. But yeah, it's it's not a good, not a good hit to make. And um, yeah, that's what happens. Oh well. Here's fight number two. Uh, this person had some magic again. You know, gives me a little wave, which is nice. Um, I like the halberd, that's cool. So that I saw, I was like, okay, I know what we're dealing with here. Someone's going to be using a lot of magic. And um, yeah, so basically what I found is, you know, just trying to keep moving, dodging in and out. You don't want to overly commit, which I still do a lot. Um, and I roll, a panic roll, so I almost dodge all of those. She's got thrusting attacks as well, which is quite useful. Uses spells quite well. Um, and I need to find my opening. There it was, but I wasn't quick enough. Uh, I punished that. Uh, she got me with that big stab, yeah. Uh, the big spell. Uh, obviously the moon veil comes out, which is like, okay, cheese tastic, but it's quite easy to dodge. Uh, I can probably dodge into it in the uh, vertical slash. Uh, I missed there, annoyingly. I think that's quite narrow. Um, yeah, I'm still not sure about these weapons. Oh, of course she's got one of those. That gets me. Uh, lots of spells. Here I come. Miss another stab. Uh, bad roll there, but I kind of get away with it. I don't know how that missed. Um, so it might have been iframes from the spell. There we go. I get it. I tried to get another stab in, but she's too quick to roll out. Then we do some good rolling. Uh, could have maybe done a um, heavy hit there, but wasn't thinking. I tend to just RB, really. I rarely R2. So here we're just circling a little bit. Uh, neither wanting to commit. Me, myself, less so. Try and get her in first. Uh, she also has the antipo, which I don't think she actually uses it once. She comes in with that, hits me. And then it's almost over, I think. Yet she gets another one of those. Tries to get a killing blow with that. Uh, but yeah, she's pretty sure of me, but obviously doesn't want to well, yeah, commit too much. Chucks that thing. Okay, we use some magic. Uh, try to get a bit of a cheesy kill at the end. Uh, come in. Miss. Which is annoying. Oh, I see she's out of stuff. But I don't want to commit there because I don't have enough health. And then out comes the crossbow. Uh, I forgot how long this fight was. Um, yeah. Crossbow, which I've seen him multiple times. People have. I quite like when players, like, yeah, I get hit there. I'm somehow not dead. Uh, I like it coming up against people who switch weapons. It's quite nice. Uh, let's see practice, you know, at different approaches and stuff. Um, but it can also be a bit annoying. I keep just missing her with those rolls. She's quite good at weaving out of it, maintain distance. I roll, I, I tend to roll too early, 
I need to get a bit closer for that roll and then the hit. And there it's over. I managed to get some good hits on her at the end. It's close, but I mean... <laughs> and then the disrespectful teabag. But it was kind of fine from her. It was a good fight. Um, there's worse coming up. There's some really cheesy shit coming up. This guy was the one I was thinking of at the beginning. Uh, he's got the same armor as me, actually. Um, so this guy really caught me off guard. His moveset, I was just not... But the attacks he does are the... Yeah, really got me. You could see it from the first from the first one. I was not expecting it. It was a it was a weird one. And I did not react well to it. I managed to get a stab and he punches me. I'm like, okay. It doesn't do too much damage. So I was like in and then that got me. That gets me several times when it really shouldn't have. Uh so I'll roll it that time. I managed to roll it there. I needed to hit there rather than roll. Uh, yeah, that gets me the follow-up as well, and yeah, I'm pretty um, unsure how to deal with that. He's able to get out of it. I'll do a little little jump there as well for some reason. Uh, I come here, commit, manage to get a stab him, but he's he's got a lot of armor, and uh, I I don't know. I'll try and go the double stabs. It's obviously not going to work. He you know has good damage, you know, good defense. Uh, those. You know, stabbers aren't going to do much against the Fall of Dan set, uh, which I also wear. Now, this guy here was a real pain in the ass because he immediately tries to backstab me. Uh, and he wasn't very good. Uh, he just relied on Madness Philip. You see, I do a lot of damage early here to him. Uh, he does mad slashes, and then here, here comes the cheesy tactics. Yeah, lots of madness. He comes with the Madness Beam as well in a moment. There it is. Yeah, that'll, that can one-shot you. He just wants to do Madness build-up. I really should have punished this guy. Had I been a little bit more... You know, had this not been like the fourth or fifth fight, I might have been warmed up a bit more. Okay, he was quite good at rolling out of that. I really should have avoided that. Uh, he gets his... Oh, no, not quite yet. Right. He does press well with that. Okay, here comes the Madness trying to kill me there but I've got a lot of health really shouldn't have let that have got me that was stupid um, yeah and you know he's somewhat aggressive but he's not he's decent at rolling probably kind of same ability I have with rolling I'll get hit again by that um, but yeah I really should have punished him really annoying tactics this and you can see like when I hit him I do a fair bit of damage so yeah, that, that, that is an annoying attack, that. There he comes with the jump. Should have hit him there. Really should have hit him there. Managed to roll through. And I shouldn't have gone for the, the follow-up. Well, maybe. He rolled well. Um, so, you know, he's got less health than me now. I think. Or we're roughly the same. And, uh, and then, yeah, sort of back off a bit. Wait for an opening. And then I think I just roll in, miss. So that was really should have waited. And then somehow that hits me, which is a little bit bullshit. Uh, but yeah, I really wish I would have punished this guy because I hate that madness shit. All right, this guy was very good. Uh, this guy, yeah, he was very good. He was quick with those spells. He wasn't cheesy. Um, but yeah, this guy's very good. You'll see. I mean, there's little I can say about this. He's good at casting his spells. I managed to dodge that. That hits me somehow. Uh, he's very quick at rolling out. He's very good at getting his spells off and rolling multiple ways. I did a stupid thing there. Uh, yeah, super fast attacks. Just dodges mine very well. Uh, that's one, you know, let down at the stabby weapons. You can only really go forward. You can't really slash. Uh, I don't think I even get a hit on him. To be honest. Oh, I think I get one, maybe. Uh, but yeah, that that fortunately doesn't hit me. Otherwise, that would have killed me easily. I go in to try and punish the uh, FP re regen. Uh, yeah. Alright, I get a hit on him there. That was good. Um, quite proud of that, actually. Um, but yeah, this guy is obviously a very skilled uh, duelist. And yeah. But he doesn't even bow at the end, which is a, bit, a little bit of a letdown. This prick. 
you see uh, Rivers of Blood and the Dung Eater um, and you really know what you're going to get. Now, yeah, I'll, I'll comment on this in a moment. Anyway, I knew what this guy was going to do. He was going to Rivers of Blood, uh, whatever it's called, Corpse Piler. But um, he starts off by just doing these weird parries, which I'm not sure what they were. Uh, so I'm a little bit confused at here. Then I sort of do a couple of stupid rolls and just hit him. And he's, I mean, he's, he's not great. But here we go. Here's the Rivers of Blood. And now I really should get this. But I run in. I just don't dodge out. I should have just been patient. And that gets you. And when you're in that, you're stuck in that. And you're dead, basically. And it's, it's frustrating because that guy was just... I don't know. I should have beaten him. Uh, another Rivers of Blood, I believe. Uh, this guy. Yeah, cool pose, though. Arts Leb. Um... I don't know what that ring actually means. Uh, so I couldn't move there for a moment for some reason. Uh, yeah, another Rivers of Blood. I knew what to expect. Um, but yeah, he starts off with some normal slashes. I'm obviously trying to bait his corpse piler. There it is. It gets me a little bit. You just have to get away from that, basically. You can't you can't tank it. Uh, just some stupid rolls there, which I shouldn't have let happen. Um, but it's just annoying, like, these dudes who not really great at fighting but just relying on just like multi-tapping L2 and catching you in it. So I try and punish that and get punished myself for it because I just need to, yeah, I needed to roll that. Again, kind of shitty if you're just spamming that because it's very overpowered at the moment and yeah, it's it's not, it's not good fighting. Oopsie. Who do we have here? Okay, I don't remember this. I think I'll lose this. Oh yeah, I remember this fight. So this was this was quite a good one. Um, yeah, he's got the bloodhound, uh, bloodhound's fang. Um, so I was pretty sure he was going to do that. Uh, he didn't do it as much. Uh, I get behind him there, but again, he's got a good damage absorption, so I didn't do a lot of damage. A couple of yeah, he lands a hit. I just stand there and take it for some reason. Uh, because I, I, mean, I assume I was trying to get a hit. Right. It's easily punished, but he just, I mean, he spams it. Which, you know, I don't know. Uh, I never use a weapon art on this, actually. Uh, the ones on here aren't very good. I mean, maybe I should. Maybe I should just go with a meta uh, blood and spamming weapon arts. Okay, this, I kind of just back off here because, you know, he can't really hurt me with it if I'm far away. Uh, okay. He uses the madness thing and it's like, okay, you're one of these guys. You're just going to try and spam the flavor of the month. Uh, which is, yeah, whatever. He's got the lightning as well. Yep. See that? Always try and, always try and punish it. Come in here. Yep. Now, the one way I die a lot is either by... Yeah, it's usually just over committing when I shouldn't. Being too, being too forward. Uh, not being patient. And you'll, I think you'll see that here. So, ah, actually, no, not on this one. But yeah, a cheesy way to end it. Kind of, kind of lame. And then, oh yeah, cool. Yeah, you're so good at this game. Uh, yeah, fuck off. <laughs> What's this? Okay. Yes, I thought we we're gonna get something worse than we actually did here. Uh, nice bow, sword and shield, and this is just a pure straight up fight. Uh, weapon against weapon. Uh, Logan. Yeah, so he's got the big thrust. I've got a thrust, which is quite fun. Don't know how that first one missed. I take a huge hit for doing a tiny bit of damage. A good roll there. Weird, inter interesting sword out there. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, he's got a power shield, but yeah. So here, bang, bang. Little poke. Little pokes. That's kind of what I have to do with this. Just the little pokes. He gets this out. And I thought, okay, great. I'm going to get some weapon art spam here. Uh, only a little bit. And there, bang. I get two really good hits in. And then I fuck it up. And then I really fuck it up, trying to get that last little tick, tick of health away. Completely overcommit and, it, you know, responds really well. I should have just been more patient, uh, as I was just mentioning. Uh, this one, uh, 
Unk. I don't know what that's meant to say. Uh, weird. Okay, so the little, the little things. So I think, yeah, right. I'm just gonna go straight in. Okay, you're gonna do some lightning. Tank a hit there. Roll pretty well. Uh, managed to take her out of that with another hit. And then ooh, I get a good hit and she gets a decent hit. And then I can just double tap there and get my win. Uh, which is fantastic. Uh, I was getting a bit annoyed here because, you know, lots of cheesy uh, fights. But uh, yeah, we get it. And finally, this fight, uh, which is quite fun, actually. If I remember correctly, um, lots of buffing here, lots of buffing, and he's got, uh, is that the Naginata? Yeah, he's got the Naginata, so I was expecting some jump attacks, um, but yeah, lightning, spear, another one, and then this one gets me, because I don't recognize it, it gets me the first time, which is a stupid way to get hit, dodge it that time, Do does a jump attack, I Tank another big bit of damage. Get rid of his flask. Uh, this thing is so annoying, but it could have done a lot more damage. Again, take loads of damage here. Uh, and then, bam, managed to dish out a little bit myself, but it's not looking good. Uh, he's very much on the up. And then here, drinks that. I try and get in there. Stabs me again. And then that I managed to punish. And then... We finish each other off. I should have backed off there, but I wanted to commit, get that hit in there, and it kind of paid off. It was a it was a draw, a good fight though. That was a fun one. Uh, anyway, yeah, that's um, that's all the fights. Uh, we'll probably do a lot more in the future. Uh, oh, look at this! Uh, it's that dude. Anyway, bye bye.